right? So one of the main activities in Malaysia is to go see the Batu Caves. So I ended up coming here um, on my own. A lot of people from my hostel came yesterday and I wasn't feeling up for it. I was a bit tired. So yeah, I'm here now. I don't have sunglasses, mainly because I think they're in my room, but I couldn't find them. I didn't want to wake up everyone because I'm here pretty early. I was one of the first to get up. Um, but yeah, walking up to it now looks lovely. It looks like a lot of it's quite shaded, which is good. So, at least my sunglasses not being here isn't terrible. And to us, it is a cave, so that makes sense. Um, so yeah, be inside. But wow, this is stunning. This is so big. Entering a no smoking area. On smoking hearts, does that count? <laughs> Whoa. I feel like such a tourist holding my GoPro out. I don't really know what you have to do, if you have to go pay, if you have to like go through somewhere. Looks like a lot of people go over there. What am I saying to pay? Um, wow. That's so cool. Probably there's loads of monkeys around here. Oh, there's one over there. Oh, there's one. I'm saying that. I haven't even looked at the floor to actually see them. Uh, they're definitely going to steal my water bottle out of my hand. Cool. Oh, there's those like fruits and stuff. Over this way. So I could buy some sunglasses. monkeys <laughs> these steps are very very steep to be climbing up Got good little rest stops as you go up, which is nice. It's a workout. Four more. Four more flights. Oh, that's cool. Just about taller than that statue in front. Ooh, smells a lot of uh, monkey poo. Dude's got a banana. Oh, he jumped down. Ooh. Two more. Oh, there's a little baby monkey. A 
Oh. Oh. Your baby's so cute. <laughs> Rose is clinging on. Whew. Holding on for dear life as the monkey just jumps around. Cool, right, we've made it. I don't know how many steps that was. It was a lot. I feel quite high up. Hello, Mr. Man. You having a coconut? Dude, don't need a table, he's got his foot. He seems pretty chill. Don't need a pal. Right. Oh, let's go in. Let's learn some history. Monkeys everywhere. I knew they were here, but I didn't realize how many of them there were. There's a load. Just walking, chilling. Wow. I don't know how much my GoPro is going to pick up, but it looks good. Whew. Some gift shots kind of about. Oh, I've got a temple in here. To be honest, I probably should have read up a little bit before coming, but I thought they would have like little plaques places and telling you about the history. I guess they normally do that in the UK, but maybe they don't do it here. This place is massive. Am I allowed to walk through the temple? Oh, you got to take your shoes off. And am I allowed to record? It doesn't say no. But it does say no shoes. So, maybe I'll take my shoes off and go have a look while I'm here. I will stop recording, just in case. I'm not allowed to. Okay, there's a few people recording, so I think it should be fine. There's not a load to it, to be fair. Ticket corner. Don't know what that's for. Going in and seeing it. load to see. I don't really know what they're doing. I wish some of this was English. I don't know if I can actually read it. But it's their temple so it completely makes sense why it's not English. But yeah, it would be nice to have some translations maybe outside of the temple or something. Because um, I don't really know what the hell I've just watched. But 
it was cool, whatever it is. Hopefully no one stole my shoes. There's monkeys about. Walked around with my fresh crepes on. Be very upset. Yeah. Nice day. Yeah. Looks like I've got my shoes back. Oh, I, love it. I guess I'll walk over that way next and go see what's a bit further down. Okay, right. Shoes back on. We are moving. This is the, uh, the place that I just went inside. All over here. Wow, the peacocks look lovely. That so cool. Um, yeah. Now we're going to climb up some more stairs. Srivali Devani Murugan. There you go. Probably butchered that. Oh, it's a fire going up. Mm, smells quite nice. It smells like you burn like incense or something. Oh, there's that. Like... Oh, or chickens running around. Mm. Cool wildlife. Right, I guess we'll go up these then. I'll choose the far left one again. As we go up. A few less monkeys inside. I guess they like all the outside. But there is one over there. Scranning. Hey pal. Hello. Eating an apple. Big crunch. Big crunch from my dude. That's so cool man. I haven't seen many monkeys up close. Normally they're all in cages. Yeah. They're cool. I like them. I kind of wish I bought some food so I could give them some, like hand feed them. But I'm sure there'll be plenty of time to do that in my trip. Oh. Oh, wow, wow. That's so cool. Looks like something off of like Uncharted. Dodge all the people so I don't get in their shots. Wow, look at that. That's so cool. I don't know how much my GoPro gets. But that's wicked. Wow. That's really cool. You can see that monkey on the side. I don't know, I don't know if my GoPro could pick that up, but monkeys just climbing down the sides. Oh, you can hear them as well. Loads of them. Hello, pigeon. Not quite sure what they're for. Oh, monster fire. Monkey flying all over the place. I'm literally just here for the monkeys at this point. What's going on here? Oh. I guess that's what all the, the burning things are. They end up getting something. I really need to learn the history about this place pretty bad. I thought there would have been, yeah, signs up telling me of all about it, but a typical foreigner I am literally knows nothing about it. There are some English words on here I can try and have a look at. Okay. You look like all the timings and stuff. And then we've got a ticket price. I'd be shaking um, 351 ringgit. Uh, I guess so they just like buying fruit and stuff. Fruit. Ar Archani. 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 I guess that's what they sell. I don't know if you can be actually part of it. Oh, he's 
kneeling down with incense. Oh, that is, it's like a, not an offering of some kind, but they're praying. Right. Well, that was, um, that's the caves. I'm at the end. It was quite a quick journey, to be honest. Um, but yeah, definitely quite, um, definitely quite long to get up the stairs. But otherwise it was pretty quick, just kind of looking inside the caves. But they're so cool. Like the religion stuff is, yeah, one thing, but then the actual just net natural history, how this is all like carved out, is insane. Like, how has this happened? I don't understand it. But yeah, as I said, it looks like something off of Uncharted. Looks really cool. But now it's time to descend down the stairs. Maybe looking at it this way, you can actually see how, um, how tall it all is. Well, stairs are like, Different sizes. Some are pretty wide. Got some like this, which are like a bit smaller. But okay, right. I don't think there's anything more exciting going on other than me walking down some stairs. So I'm gonna like maybe record once I'm at the bottom. Um, but yeah, otherwise it's just the same thing to see. But cool. Happy I experienced it. Happy I came. It's really cool. Really cool caves. Yeah. Dope. All right. I'll show you when I'm down, down the bottom. Right, I just came out to like the top of um, the first set of stairs are, and uh, I looked up. There, it looks a bit like a body that's like hanging. I know it's not. I hope it's not. I thought it looks like two feet, but I think it's just the how the cave is. But yeah, it was really cool, really high up. Yeah, not, um, no body, I don't think. I hope not. I don't think they would. It's not that kind of place. I don't think I really, really should much of that. Either. Sri Udomban Temple. There you go. Something to research when I get back home. Right, back down the stairs. Just saw this monkey. Nice. Bro uh, just stole the water bottle. Ooh. Got very close to a monkey then. Ooh. Got very close to him by accident. Um, monkey just stole a water bottle from someone's hand and then opened it and chucked it on the floor. <laughs> I'm carrying mine like very loosely, so I'm a bit worried. One's gonna come up behind me and do it to me. Alright, we're almost down. A few more flights left. Right, it's getting very warm now. It's like half eleven. Um, made it down from the top of the stairs. Um, a bit of research from myself is that there are 272 stairs going up there. Um, which doesn't sound like too many, but that's quite a few flights. If you think about in a house, there's normally about 10 stairs. So that's um, it's a lot of houses to be climbing up. Um, yeah. This is, uh, I think it's apparently supposed to be like 400 million years old when I looked into it. It's crazy how, how old that is. Um, I think obviously like the steps and stuff are not that old, but um, yeah, the caves themselves, insane, insane. Um, but yeah, that's the Hindu god. Um, right up on there, I, uh, I don't remember what the Hindu god's name is, but um, yeah, I think it's the biggest statue that I've ever seen in my life. And I think I ever will see, it's huge. Um, yeah, I'd actually be interested to know how actually tall that is. Um, yeah, got someone to take a picture of me in front of it, which was nice considering I came here on my own. Oh, God, it's hot. And I'm squinting as well. A lot. Because of no sunglasses. Ooh, stand in some shade. Yeah, it was really good. Would recommend. Would recommend going. I think there's supposed to be like some attractions and stuff over to the left, I was told by some people at my hostel. Sorry, just walked in front of a, a picture. There's so many people taking pictures here. I feel so bad just getting in all of them. Dodge that one as well. Ooh, can't get over it though. It's all like limestone, I think. Crazy. Some music going on from over here. Let's go have a look to see what's going on. 
a lot of um, there's a lot of like, little temples around that you put you inside that you've got to take your shoes off to go into they look really cool inside really a load of really nice art but um, but yeah wow okay I'll show you all this this looks really cool I'm always a sucker when it comes to like water features and things like that and this is one of the pigeons so nice. A lot of people in this viewing spot, which I think is the best place to be. Let me try a perch on the end. That's a lot of pigeons. And a lot of fish. That little waterfall looks lovely. God, so many pigeons. There's more pigeons here than there are in London. Yeah. The hell? They're just everywhere. Um, yeah, I was told there was more attractions this way, but it doesn't really look yet. I'll have a little walk down and see. I am sweating bricks though. I did put some sun cream on, so hopefully I'm, I am a bit covered. But, oh, it's so warm. And there's just no breeze at all. Oh, I love the flowers. No breeze. Very nice colour. Easily distracted. When it comes to going more, I don't know. If, actually, this is probably terrible lighting, isn't it? Because the sun's directly behind me. I haven't really got used to this whole vlogging thing yet of understanding lighting stuff. But like, if I'm walking this way and I'm supposed to be trying to vlog it, you know, I can't just be walking backwards. Unless like people go to the other side first and then walk back and vlog that. But I don't know. Five ring it for an art gallery. Oh, looks pretty good. I like going there. Five ringgit, that's like nothing. That's like a pound? A quid? Do you have a look? It looks like they've got some animals in there. Monkeys are climbing on the bars. Whoa! Okay, I'm glad I walked down this way. Oh, there's stuff going on. There's drums playing. Oh, take my shoes off though. Are these, like, cliffs? I just can't get over. It looks so cool. All right, let's go look at the drumming. I don't want to miss it. Take my shoes off over here. Ooh. I don't think my feet are very clean, to be honest. That's the thing I've been foot before. Oh, the floor's hot.
how good the, um, the sound quality is for my GoPro. I guess I'll find out when I'm editing this to see actually how good you guys can hear that. But it sounds amazing. I don't even know what instrument that is. It shows how uncultured I am. I'm going to find out what instrument that is. There's another massive statue. Again, I don't know who that is. Wow. These places are amazing though. Right for the colour. People think they can take a picture of me. <laughs> They've got kids, so hopefully they'll be more inclined to take a picture. So I'm gonna stop the GoPro now and try and get one. Right, I've got a picture taken. I should have done the moves that the um, the god is doing. He's kind of like putting his arms up. Um, I didn't actually realise until she showed me the picture afterwards, and I already said it was fine. Um, typical Brit of me, instead of like asking her to take another one I was like yeah completely fine don't worry about it thank you so much Whew. back out in the sun again it was nice and cool actually at the temple had a nice breeze coming through it was all shaded but oh the crown's so hot the crown's so hot oh, oh, oh. right I'm turning this off so I can put my shoes on Ooh. it looks like once they're done with the with the temple there's some like chairs all out here for eating. It smells like very, very good food. I don't know what's happening here. Some event, I guess, or if this happens every Monday. But, uh, oh my god, that's cool. Those are my parrots. Pardon? No camera, no worries. <laughs> Let me throw my camera in their face. Oh, parrots. Oh my god, monkeys everywhere. Oh, this is like a feeding place for them. This is where they get all their bananas. It's got a name tag on it or anything to know which god it is. I know there's one Hindu god called Krishna, but I need to learn. I feel very British coming here. I'll take it. I need to go in this way. But, uh, oh, this is where the um, art gallery is. Yeah, I came here for the for the caves really, so that's uh, that's all I'm gonna do. I was tempted to go into that um, the art gallery in the zoo, but uh, I think the there's like the cages are so small for the animals. I don't really wanna wanna give money over. I know it's only five ringgit, so it's only a quid, but still, I don't really wanna yeah support that. So right, I think I'm done with this place. I need to go find some shade. What's in there? It's just uh, I think it's all setting up for stuff. That's water and stuff like that. But yeah, I think I'm gonna find some shade, book my grab, and um, and go back to the hostel. But yeah, very cool. That's a really big iguana that I want to show you, but I wasn't allowed to. Uh, not allowed to record it. Very sad. He's a big boy. Right. Peace out. This was my Batu Caves, um, yeah, exploration. Um, I'll probably end the video here because it's been a long, long one of actually just exploring the Batu Caves myself. Hopefully you can hear me. But yeah, it's been great. And uh, yeah, this is my fifth day now in Malaysia. So slowly, um, yeah, slowly going through my trip. Almost a full week now. Yeah, really enjoying it at the moment. Yeah, you can see the cages here. Actually, they look like a decent size. Those are probably a bit smaller. I don't know what's in them though, it could be like birds. Yeah, anyway, 
I'm in the video here. Thanks for watching. Um, thanks for, yeah, watching the way through and seeing my, my journey. See you in the next video. Peace.